Hi, I'm Seamless, and this is the 11th 75k tutorial. This one was requested by S Saber the Dude, and this is a track from Pilot, and it's about the bass. And basically, I mean, it's a pluck, filter pluck. Not really that big a deal, but the reason I took out the sound is because an alarming number of people don't associate with this sound as being a plucked saw. It is a plucked saw. It's one of the most basic ideas ever made. And actually someone in the chat pointed out that it's a preset in pretty much every plugin ever made. And I really just wanted to put it into your heads if this was if this was ever a mystery to you that this is what the sound is. And I'm not necessarily saying that you should have known or that you're an idiot for not knowing, but it's this is just what that is. And a lot of things will be easier for you if you just sort of accept that like 80% of all sound design is based on saw waves. And the rest of it's probably square waves. So if uh, if that's ever like if you don't know where to go, don't know what to do, how to do whatever, this mixture of saws and filters is so much stuff. And I'm also surprised at the number of things that are plucks coming in in the, in the the 75ks. But I guess that's just you know trends. Anyway, that's this guy. It's a, I put a pluck, an envelope pluck on on a low pass filter, and I put on some unison. I also use some some phase randomness, which I guess is mostly to taste, and a tiny bit of distortion with a filter farther down instead of higher up is usually what I have. And a mix of, of the clean and, and the dry. To add an extra bit of heft. But a lot of the texture of the, um, a lot of the texture of this, of the sound is, uh, sort of covered up by the other sounds in the song. So that's why this very dark sounding thing could still be that thing that was in that, in that song. Yeah. I'm not going to put out this patch because this is really very simple. And if everything that I described to you is somehow still a mystery to you, I look harder, I guess. I guess I'm just being an asshole, but that's okay. Anyway, someone in the chat says, try set telling that to serum saw waves and square waves. Here's the thing about saw waves and square waves. Even if it's not a saw wave or a square wave, literally, because this it still has saw wave or square wave harmonics, which is why most sound design is either square waves or saw waves. Like you saw me do in the harpsichord, that's not a that's not a saw wave, but it has saw wave harmonics, and like a lot of the hollow sounding, and you, you describe it yourself when like looking at like a particular kind of bass that like Skrillex does or Zombo or something, you th you say, oh, that square wavey sounding so bass, even though it's not even close to being an actual square wave, and it's because it's based on square wave harmonics, and so that's, that's actually why I, I almost never change what's going on up here in the timbre windows because it's whatever sound I'm going to be doing is either going to be based on saw wave harmonics or square wave harmonics. That's just what's up with that. Anyway, if you would like to make a request, please use the Reddit thread link in the description of this video. Requests made anywhere else will be ignored completely. If you have any questions about this, please let me know. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and as usual, have a nice day. Where's the, where's the go button?